With it only being his second year as head of the program, Coach Stephon Smith led the Clark Central Gladiators to a region title before coming up short in the state playoffs. But he says the notion hasn't changed. Family will always be the focal point of this program because family does not let one another slack off, and they all have one common goal, and that is to win it all. That is what the Clark Central Gladiators' mission is for this upcoming year. It wasn't always in the plan to return back to Athens, but his love for the city and his influence by his mentors brought him home. Well, I went to high school at Clark Central, uh, you know, playing basketball with our coach Billy Wade. Um, so that's kind of my foundation of where I started playing basketball and really learning how to play basketball. I went to Clark Middle, <clears throat> ended up just being, uh, we ended up winning like three or four championships, so I kind of I kind of got this tag that I know what I was doing a little bit. So, and it just kind of went from there, man. I've been coaching. I came back and I ended up coaching with my old coach, Coach Billy Wade, for years. Uh, we were chasing that dream of winning the state championship. So I was trying to get him over the hump, uh, you know, just to have that pride of saying somebody, a boys team in Athens won the state championship. Although the Gladiators haven't won a state championship, they have won a region one. Last year, the Gladiators won the region amidst COVID and having other problems amongst the team, trying to find time to practice. So we quarantined twice, so we ended up having to reschedule region games. So we were playing like three, four games a week. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I remember one week we played Monday, Tuesday, we were off that wins, we played Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So, and we were able to win those games, but I think it kept us focused because we didn't have time to mess around. You know, we had Zoom meetings. Uh, we gave them notes. Uh, we did we did a lot of walkthroughs during that time because they would get, we were actually practicing by playing. So we were going trial by five. And despite the adversity, the Gladiators finished with a 20 and seven overall record, making it to the Elite Eight. So it's not just basketball with us, you know. A lot of people can think it's just basketball, but it, it really, it's really not. You know, and I tell them all the time, as long as we go out, I don't worry about the basketball. Because as long as we go out here for them two hours and we bust our butt for them two hours, whatever whatever time frame the game is in, if we bust our butt, we can look at ourselves in the mirror and say we gave it our best shot. I have no problem. Every day inside the locker room when a player enters, the basketball staff made a list of goals to remind them as to what they're working for and to practice with a purpose. Our expectation is to win the city. Expectation is to win the region. Our expectation is to win the state. Um, now, are we going to get to those expectations? It all depends on if we, if we buy in and we play it right at the right time. But at the end of the day, like I told you, it's all about us and our, our, our family and what these guys want to be after they leave here. That's our goal every year. That's not going to change. Whether it's in the classroom or on the court, Coach Smith uses the opportunity of basketball to pour into students, helping them have some type of end goal with their lives and making sure it's more than basketball when they connect. When you want to see people, people successful, man, you know, you, 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 it's natural to you. It's not going to be an act or, you know, I'm not doing this for my personal gain. I'm not getting, you know, I'm not going, but you know, me being from here, and I just want to, you know, you want to see kid do better. And one of his players who has chosen to do better both on and off the court is a 6'4 senior, Lamar Hayes. And he says, Coach Smith plays an integral part in pouring in each and one of the players, commanding everyone to give their best and uphold the standard. Because it was just like more discipline. Like we, like, we went on those childish stuff in practice. Like, coaches just made everything more intent, more competitive, just getting each other better. And this competitive atmosphere has not let the Gladiators slow down in the pursuit of another trophy. We, we hungry to win. We hungry, we hungry for another trophy. Like we, just, we just win. We just want to go at everybody. Uh, no boys basketball team in Athens, Georgia won a state championship in 1941. It was Athens High. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we chasing that. Uh, you know, we, want to, we want to leave a legacy in Athens, Georgia. That's basically what we want to do. Right. Uh, do I want to leave Coach Smith a legacy? Nah, I tell these guys, if you win the state championship, you're going to leave a market for the rest of your life. They can't be changed. They always going to say, who won the state championship in Athens, Georgia, boys basketball. And hopefully they say Clark Central 2022. And best of luck to the Clark Central Gladiators who begin their season November 22nd and the 23rd.